Hi, I'm Erica. Welcome to my channel. I'm um, doing my video today from my car. I work in sales. I work 40 hours a week and uh, I want to try to get one of these every day and wherever I am, that's where I am today. I am in my car. So um, today I just wanted to talk a minute about the uh, Maybelline Brow Tattoo. Um, they've had this product over in Europe for a few months now and yesterday I was watching Jen Love's reviews and her makeup minute and they said that uh, the product was going to be coming to the United States and yesterday I walked into Walgreens and I was super excited because uh, they had brow tattoo there and so I went back to my office I watched a few videos on how to apply it and I got home that night or last night and I whipped it on and it said leave it on for two hours in the videos so I left it on for two hours looped it on and uh, at the end of two hours I went in the bathroom and started trying to peel off my eyebrows like they had in the videos and it wasn't working so I went and I looked at the box and there was no instructions for peeling off the makeup and I was like oh my god this is not the same product that they have been using on Europe and on YouTube I was like oh my god so now my brows are just this loopy mess and it's supposed to stay on for two days. I was like, what am I gonna do? Um, hot water obviously didn't work. Water in general, it just beaded right off. Um, started scrubbing with uh, wipes, whatever I could think of, could not get it off. I finally just gave up and I got out the nail polish remover and I wiped the nail polish remover on my brows and it helped. It got rid of all the gloop and um, it had started to smudge a little bit um, above and below from all the scrubbing and scrubbing and different products that I was trying to use. Um, but the nail polish remover cleaned it off really good here and underneath my brow and got off all the big clumpy bits of it. Um, but yeah, it, it was not the product that I thought it was. But um, it did work really well. And like I said, even the nail polish remover did not take it all off. Um, I had to refill in a little bit this morning. Um, to get a few of the spots that did come off pretty well. Um, I have a scar up here too that product just doesn't like to stick to and so I have to constantly be filling in. So I just used a little bit of brow powder this morning. It took me a few minutes. It saved me so much time. So uh, despite my lack of reading skills um, and the massive fail that was the gloops in my brows last night. Um, this is actually a really cool product. Um, the idea that I could do my brows the night before and save so much time in the morning is awesome and like I said it did not come off. I was freaking out. Um, so the Maybelline Brow Tattoo Gel and the Maybelline Tattoo brow tattoo not the same product now there still might be coming out with the gel where you peel it out that might still be coming to America but this was not the product that I thought it was but um, it ended up working out just fine and I think I'm having a pretty good brow day I actually wore the hat to emphasize my brows today so um, thanks for watching and um, I'll see you tomorrow